Hello, hello, Crafty Mandis here, and welcome to a brand new series. Yay! So, I have decided to go ahead and pick up another modded series as we wait for Rebirth of the Night to update to 3.0. So, you guys requested a skyblock, and I found something that is different than skyblock. I mean, it's a skyblock, but it's different than a skyblock. So, this is Heavens of Sorcery. So, it's created by the Phoenix Lodge, which um, is the creator of Sprout and Regrowth, which are two of my favorite mod packs. I don't think, yeah, I'm pretty sure I haven't done, I haven't done a series or anything like that on it, um, <laughs> but I really loved playing it, and in fact, uh, Regrowth is one of the ones I often, you know, kind of get it back into uh, with, with my boys, you know, when they decide to get the, the modded itch and all of that. But yeah, so it is Heavens of Sorcery. So it is a skyblock. However, instead of tech to get the materials that you need, we actually use magic. So I am super excited about this. So there's no ex nilio, nilio, however you pronounce that. You know, no more sifting through gargantuans of gravel and sand and dust and all of that, you know, same grind over and over again which, you know, we are all familiar with, with, you know, any of the skyblocks. Instead, we have this one. So I'm going to go ahead and put a picture up of the, um, the actual website for Curse, Curse Forge, and I'm going to tell you guys about this. So it says, the overworld is gone. What happened to it? You start on a small fragment, preserved by your father in a last-ditch effort to save at least part of the overworld. Utilizing the magic he teaches you, Expand your world and explore others in a unique magic-only skyblock pack with completely custom progression and resource acquisition processes. There is no skyblock companion mod, for example, Ex Nilio or Sky Reese's resources. It Reese's. Apparently, I've been eating a little bit too much chocolate and peanut butter. <laughs> Instead, progression is enabled and pulled together from multiple different mods and mechanics, along with some completely custom aspects done with the likes of Content, Tweaker, and Scavenge. There is no AE2 or RS. I don't know what the RS is, but I'm sure you guys do. Um, but storage issues are addressed by a combination of arcane archives and drastically increased stack sizes. And I must say, the, yeah, it's like most things stack to 8,100 and 92 now i oh my gosh i have i have been playing a little bit around in a creative testing world to you know kind of figure out what mods and stuff they have and oh my gosh there are so many different um like realms you can end up you know like portals you use in order to get to different worlds and stuff and oh my gosh yeah i'm definitely super excited about this because yeah i i don't think i can do another skyblock a regular skyblock i got to thinking about it and i thought of all the thousands upon thousands upon thousands of stacks of gravel i have sifted it is like uh, i don't know if i want to do that but hey i found this one which is awesome because it's from one of my favorite creators of a mod packs and it's all in magic which is something i've really wanted to get into but i most of the mod packs that i've kind of played with are tech based go figure <laughs> so yeah so let's go ahead run let's get out of f5 and let's go let's see we want to do island and we want to do home and this should yes here we go we are we are home so this is our home island i went ahead and created this before before we got started just so that I could end up, you know, making sure because I wanted to, I wanted to make sure that we were in a forest biome. So I went through several islands and oh my gosh, these trees look horrible right now. Um, just, I, yeah, I don't know. I, I wanted, I wanted to be in a forest biome. Not, not particularly sure why, but this is our island. Um, now all of the islands start out like this. So you've got this cool infused grass and then you've got regular grass. Then yeah, you can't bone meal this in order to get these. Uh, so I want to be a little bit careful with these. Um, and then we have our water source over here. We've got lots of these ironwood trees, wood or not wood, but, uh, dirt all over the place. And then we've got this weird stone. This is a metamorphic taiga stone and then a nice void here. And then little lights kind of, you know, scattered all around. So the primary focus for today is going to be to start on our quests. So if we come over here, we have our quest book. So this right here, this is our actual quest book. So we got multiple. We're going to go ahead and skip this one for right now. But, um, oh, and 
here we go. Um, let's go ahead and read these. It says, failing to stop the fall is my greatest regret. So this is our father talking to us. Though it may have cost me my life, I was at least able to save you, my child, and now you must do what I could not. So that is what our father is saying to us. Um, so he's wrote all kinds of different notes and stuff for us, you know, in this, you know, in this book. So this one right here allows us, this is our dimensional dossier. So you can kind of see, you know, there we've got, we've got a lot of stuff to explore. Um, and, and I, and I love that. So there are many worlds to travel to some of which behave far beyond what you know of our world. Here's my notes on each of them. So we'll end up doing all of that. And so we got the overworld. So this is right here. So all that's left of the old world, these remnants will have to serve to help grow your power until we can get you into other planes. Basic resources available here, infused grass, metamorphic tiger stone, and ironwood. So that's pretty much all we have in order, you know, here. But we'll end up accessing some of the other stuff as well. So we got, here we go. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay. So apparently, apparently from the multi, from the creative test world, that stuff shows up. Um, so, ooh, that, yeah. okay, so that means I need to be careful in the creative testing world because it'll show up on this side as well because I ended up, yeah, I ended up dying. And so, um, Grace Key and the ghostly shape effect preventing, yeah, okay, so. So, yeah, so that, yeah, um, so I will definitely have to remember to be careful of that. Yeah, because see, here we got, yeah, the, okay, those are, yep. Yeah. Okay, so some of the stuff will does transfer, so that's something that you'll want to be aware of when you're doing it as well. So in case you know you guys want to play this mod pack as well, be careful what you do in a secondary world. If you have a testing world, make sure that it doesn't advance beyond what um, what your let's play is, or create a different instance. So that that's that might be what I do. I might just go ahead and create a different instance. That way, I don't have to worry about that. All right, so we got here a preface. So before doing anything else, yeah, okay, we've yeah, we've already we've already done that. So that's that's how we ended up here. Um, so an end to a or an end and a beginning. So this is again our father. I'm sorry I failed you. For all I thought I was capable of, in the end I could barely protect this tiny fragment of the world. The fact that you live though gives me hope, my child. Though I am nothing but a whisper on the breeze now, I will assist you however I can. First of all, this island, small though it may be, holds some key materials. To begin to reestablish things, take these trees, for example, though you can fell them with your bare hands, their wood is innately powerful, such that even the crudest of wands carved from them may be of great use. So we, the, our first task is to actually create a wand. So let's go ahead. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, that way, let's, let, oh, oh, this one. I like this one. Uh, ba, 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 da, ba. Okay, um, I think we need to get rid of this root. Let's get rid of this root. I don't think I'm going to get anything. Nope. I'm not going to get anything from it, but at least we can end up then start working on getting this tree. So these, these are definitely going to take us a while to uh, cut down because like this, this is going to give us 47 if we don't lose it over the edge. Cause that's been one of the problems that I've had is that, <laughs> yeah, sometimes they decide to go over the edge and then you don't get the materials, but that's kind of, you know, kind of a similar thing that happens in all Skyblocks. So we're actually kind of lucky that we have this much space. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. This much space for, you know, for our first island. Okay, they're awesome. Okay, so we've got, we've got all that. So let's go ahead. We are going to do this. We are going to do like that. And then there we go. And we've got our crafting station. So we can go ahead and plop that bad boy down. And then uh, let's go ahead, let's make sticks. And then we want to go like that. And then voila, we have our very, very first wand. Oh, what? Oh, what? Huh? My spawn point. Oh, it must have ran a command or something when I ended up making this. Okay, weird. Um, <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. An end in the beginning. Okay, yeah, so oh, weird weird, but that works. Okay. So there is our first wand. So let's go ahead and come back here. So w in doing that, we now end up opening up some other things. So we got simple things. So we want iron berries and we can get that with the wand. So let's go ahead, come back. And then we need to create a wood bucket and we need to get clay. So how much? Okay. So one of the pasture seeds, 20 of the bone shards and 20 clay. So these are relatively easy to get. So this right here, so the infused, if we right click this, as you can see in my hot bar, um, we are starting to get some of the bone shards and we just got our first, well, wow, and wow, we're, we're getting a whole bunch of the infused seeds. 
And so we've got all of those so that we've got enough to fulfill the quest. Now, the other thing is clay, and that is going to be this right here. So we're going to go ahead and do that, and then we should, there we go, there we go, and see, look, we get our first stone pickaxe, and we complete the next quest. So yeah, so these, these first quests are really, really easy because it's just a matter of kind of um, getting things, you know, getting things from, you know, learning, learning what we can end up getting. And yeah, see, we, we do this and we get all kinds of iron berries and we're going to need a lot of those um, in order to get iron because uh, I am I am a little bit familiar with Rustic. I've played with Rustic in multiple packs now. So that is, you know, that is great. And then, oh, right, we need to we need to make our bucket. Uh, oh, ah, no. OK, hold on. Let's go ahead. Oop, I forgot. I uh, forgot how to make a Z bucket. Okay. Yeah. Easy, easy enough. So let's go ahead. We'll go ahead and make a slab. And the great thing is, is that from my understanding, we do not get, um, any kind of like mob spawning in here. So this is good. It's going to be fantastic. So we don't necessarily have to worry about lighting our stuff up here in the overworld. However, once we go into other dimensions, we definitely want to make sure that we don't, yeah, <laughs> we, that, that we actually light stuff up. Oh, and then let's, let's go ahead Let's go ahead and get rid of the, ooh, ooh, we got our first food from the grass. But like I said, I want to make sure that I kind of, yeah, keep some of the grass. I want to leave at least two. Um, that way I can use shears on them, pick them up, and then move them somewhere else so that we can end up creating more grass with the, with the actual bone meal. All right, so we've created the bucket. So that takes care of those. So the next thing we need to do, we need to do the tub men. Um, so... That is easy enough. So planks and stuff. So this is the, the crushing tub. And then we got the drying basin. Um, so let's see. Crushing tub. Let's go ahead. Tub. Tub. Crushing tub. Let's bring that up. Okay. So I do not. Okay. I do have enough of those. So let's make some of the planks. So we can go like that. And then we can go bloop, bloop. And then there is our crushing tub. And then, oh, if I remember correctly, we need, yeah, regular terracotta. So that means we actually need to do, and I keep, I keep backing out of it. Um, we need to make the furnace. Um, and we actually get, we actually get more furnaces out of it. So now your furnace is not going to be your standard recipe. Uh, so where we are, we are going to need to use the, the taiga cobblestone and the clay. Those things, you know, definitely make it a little bit easier to make. So we need two of our lovely clay blocks. And then let's go ahead and head over here. And, um, okay. I got, mm-hmm. Okay. I know this one kind of goes down. So we need one, two, oh, three. Okay. Ah, missed that one. Okay, four. And I'm not going to be able to get back up. That's okay. All right. Five. Yeah, we definitely, we definitely have enough. So let's go ahead and yep. We are going to fall into the void maybe. Yep. Okay. All right. But, but all right, let's see. Can I, Oh, okay. Whoa. Okay. I didn't hit the leaf. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, something went flashy. Something went flashy. Oh, and there are seeds there. Ah, okay. Um, gonna have to oh, okay break my way out of here oh there we go Oop. okay got the water yes haha -ha. yeah the thing that I saw was the oh okay here we go let's see there we go we got two okay awesome yeah I saw a flashy but I don't know what it yeah I don't know what it was for okay so we are gonna slowly heal up well nope not really because I need to yeah I need to eat there we go we got a couple berries I'm gonna keep those for right now all right, so we have, yes, we have the materials in order to make our furnace. So we can do that. So we got our furnace. That will get us more furnaces, which is fantastic. We can end up making more charcoal and all of that. So let's do that. And then our clay. Okay, that gives us three. So that, yeah, so that definitely works out. Let's put in the planks because I don't want to waste the charcoal on that. And then we could go char, oh, nope, charcoal and ironwood. And then that'll make some more charcoal for us. So that'll be, that'll be awesome. Sweet. Okay. So we definitely have, we definitely have a good start. This doesn't give me a whole lot, but it'll give me some. 
So yeah, so with that, we've got we've got the furnaces complete. So the next thing that we're working on is the tubmen, which means we need to get the you know the drying basin and stuff. And so that's going to allow us to make the um the lovely drying basin. Here we go. And so that this is going to help us make the oh, and I got an extra one. Ha ha. Um, it's going to make allow us to make the actual iron. So let's see what it says in here. I don't want to yeah, I don't want to clutter up this area too much. But we've got so one tiny pile of iron dust and we've got the iron ingot. So let's grab our lovely lovely whoop. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So yeah, so it's it's this one. It's this one. You you, you jump on this goes. So we're going to jump in, jump in, jump in. Okay. And then we can grab that. I think, yeah, there we go. And so then we basically sit here and we wait for these to dry out and that'll allow us to actually get our, um, our iron and stuff. And so it does, it does, it does take a while. It, it does take a while to, you know, actually get through all of this, but it is definitely very much worth it. Um, so let's go ahead and go back here and let's see. Yeah. So we definitely, yeah, we definitely still have a few left in here. So yeah. See, here we go tiny piles of iron dust. And then with this, we can either throw them directly into the actual furnace to get the iron nuggets, or we can end up um, putting them together in order to make the iron dust. And this will actually give us a, um, an iron ingot instead. And so this actually takes, you know, takes less coal in order to actually do that. So we got eight from that. So let's go ahead. We're going to want to do that. So we are going to want more because the quest only requires us to do actually just, just one. And oh my gosh, I am definitely getting hungry. All right. Yeah, I think that's going to be our biggest thing right now, especially since I ended up having that fall. <laughs> is food. Food is going to be a necessity, but we're, yeah, we'll, we'll slowly, we'll slowly get there. And yeah, right now. Okay, there we go. There we go. So we can go ahead and make ourselves our first iron ingot so let's go ahead and do that i mean yeah i am definitely really really excited about this because yeah just the mods and stuff they have in it i mean we got batania um which is pretty typical for you know kind of magic mods and stuff like that and then we've got um blood uh, blood magic there is let's see what else uh what else did i recognize oh wait uh arcane yeah arcane archives which was mentioned um let's see bewitchment bewitchment is a new one that I haven't, yeah, I haven't done before. Ooh, and we've got, okay, we've got three iron. So let's go ahead and come over here. So, yeah. Okay, so now we're getting into the cauldron and stuff. So this should be, this should definitely be interesting. Oh, oh. Um. Uh, hello? <laughs> it, hmm, okay. It was all kinds of, um, yeah, all kinds of misty there. I, hmm. I'm really confused. <laughs> I don't know what was going on. Oh my gosh. Okay. So let's go ahead. We are getting close to time for the episode, but let's go ahead and check this out. So, and then, so we've got one cauldron, which is going to end up giving us more of the pasture seeds. So, okay. They did modify the recipe here. Okay. So then it might actually be worth, hmm, let's come down here. Oh, oh, no, no. All right. So. Let's grab, oh, okay, now we can grab that stuff out. All right, there we go. Um. All right, so we got that. Now let's go ahead and get some more of these out so I can make some planks. And then what we can do is go ahead and add that in there. And then we can smelt these up to make some of the nuggets so that we can make our cauldron. We are going to want some more of the, you know, more of these because I do, yeah. Let's, because I want to make shears. I want to make sure that we get two of these guys. There we go. We got two and now we can kind of store that aside. That way we can have, you know, we can have some more grass and stuff for later. I know at some point we'll end up making it to another dimension that has grass, but for, I think for right now, yeah, we're, we're just going to need to just need to kind of work with it for right now. So let's throw those in there. So that'll give us 11. So one ingot and two and yeah, we definitely, we we're definitely going to need a lot more than that. Oh my gosh. We, <laughs> we definitely have lots of berries. Ooh, ooh, more seeds, more seeds. Yeah. And that's definitely one of the things we definitely want to remember to kind of come around because the trees do actually drop stuff. 
And then, yeah, okay, let's, okay, we're, oop, ah, oh, I need to get out of here. There we go, there we go. Put that in there, and we need to make some more. There we go. All right, throw that in there. So, yeah, so we are definitely, we are definitely making some progress. So, for next episode, so off camera, I'm going to do some grind work and stuff, and then with the, we, we are, yeah, we are working on, we will work on some more of the beginning quests and stuff. I know with, with the cauldron, that definitely opens up a lot more um, in terms of what we are able to do and what kind of materials we have. It's like I know we can end up making dirt and stuff, which means that we can we can end up expanding, which is what I which is definitely something I really really want to do. That way we can actually start getting things a little bit more organized and all of that. Because yeah, I am. Um, <laughs> I need I need my organization without it yeah <laughs> I kind of fall apart <laughs> but that, that is all right we yeah we've got so yeah so we've got cauldron so let's see it's five yeah we need five of them Oop, pressing all kinds of wrong buttons over here so we just need to wait we got two more in here and then that allows to make the cauldron and then that means for a next episode we can just jump right in to making some more of this stuff, which is definitely, yeah, definitely got me. Oh, we, okay. We've already got an extra. I forgot. I forgot we had one in here and we have cauldron. All right. So let's go ahead and take a quick gander at what we have coming up next. So we have man, 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 man oh, man, 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 man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> As I try to say banana for the first time, it's like banana, na, 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 na. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So we definitely, so we are going to be getting into mana for the next episode. So I'm thinking, oh, I need to grab some more there. So I will, I will continue to kind of work on getting some of this stuff, you know, kind of situated and, and all of that. And I'm going to eat some of these cause I, yeah, I'm definitely, I need, I need food. Um, but yeah, so we will, we, uh, whoa, <laughs> we will get into getting more materials and all of that. Um, and I will, you know, I'll try to do some of the grind work off camera in between episodes so that, you know, we've got, we've got some materials to actually work with, you know, like, like the iron. So I definitely hope that you guys have enjoyed this, you know, first episode of the new series and yeah. And then if you did, definitely hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, click the mantis icon to subscribe, then hit the bell button to get notified when I put out additional content. Want to check out more of my videos? Try the one on the left, or you could check out the playlist on the right. That's it for now, but I'll see you guys in the next episode.